hi everyone thank you for clicking on our channel today i will be demonstrating to you how the remote control works and what you are to expect if your remote got damaged and you need to replace your remote control so we have two floodlights here the 100 watt floodlight and the 200 watt floodlight both of them can be powered using the same remote control they're from the same suppliers and that is one of the key things when you're selecting a remote control for your solar floodlight just in case it got damaged you have to ensure that the brand of floodlight matches with the remote control that you're using so we have here this remote control auto meaning that when you press this button it will automatically comes on when it gets dark and you have the power button to turn it on the first time you're going to use it you must press the on button on the remote these floodlight doesn't come with a power button attached to the floodlight itself hence you have to use a remote to turn it on the first time you're going to use it but if you set it on auto you don't have to use a floodlight daily then you have three hours five hours and eight hours what this mean you can set the light to turn on and off within three hours please press the button number three and it will stay on for three hours then it will go out then you have here this icon here that looks like a sun when you press this button let me turn it on when you press this button you are basically turning up the brightness when you press the off bright you are turning down the brightness as you can see the lighting is being reduced right in front of your eyes and i will just turn it back up right okay so as i was saying earlier about the type of remote control to power these lights i can also demonstrate to you with a different type of remote so this one is very different from what i showed you earlier this is the one for the lamps and this one is not the one for the lamps so let us try and turn it on using the one that doesn't belong to the lamp so on this type of remote you have induction induction is what you use to turn it on and you have always induction can also be used to set it so that it is not as bright so it would be like motion activated and always mean that it will stay on bright when we press this button there is battery in the remote right now however when we are pressing it's not coming on because it doesn't it's not it the remote for the floodlight however if you press the word off on this remote voila they will turn on right but that's not what you're looking for you're looking for the correct remote for your floodlight and if you press induction it will turn off so that is the reason why it is important to get the correct remote control for your floodlight just in case your remote got damaged i have over here a 60 watt floodlight this one is quite different different brand this one indicate to you the level of charge when the panel is attached to the light so it will show you if the light is at 25 percent 50 percent 75 percent or 100 percent charge let me see if this one is charged and again the remote for this light is similar to the, the ones that comes with these floodlight even though it's two different suppliers two different brand they use the same technology as it relates to remote so you'll find that this remote will be able to turn on this light all right so and you can turn it off you can set it on auto just the same you turn it off but when you try to use the one with always an induction it will not come on it will not do anything for this floodlight not doing anything as just as they as i showed you before with the 100 watt and the 200 watt there this remote was able to turn it on and off using off and induction but for this light it does nothing nothing for it 
it will not turn it on it will not do anything so this one definitely need the correct remote in order to operate it see so this is the correct remote but this remote can also operate this light thank you guys for watching please feel free to subscribe to our channel please share this video with other persons thank you very much see you again in another video